inducing. Stand up and just declare, I have an appetite for holiness. Come on, come on, say it one more time. I have an appetite. And it's going to be. It shall be as for me and my house. Holiness will be our standard. Come on, get out there and shout. Come on, get out there and shout the victory. Holiness, holiness is right. Holiness, oh, holiness is coming to my house. Shout like holiness is coming to your house. Shout like holiness is coming to your house. Shout like holiness is coming into your house. Woo! Holiness is coming to my house. Come on, somebody give God some praises. All right, do this for me. Shake your fist in the devil's face. Say, did you hear me? Holiness is coming to my house. Ah, Jesus. Woo! Woo! My God. My God, my God. Oh, Jesus. Mm. Holiness is right. Tonight, I thank God for all of you that came out tonight and thought it were not robbery to serve our God. Let's go to 2 Kings, first, uh, first verse. 2 Kings 2, verse 1. And it came to pass when the Lord would take up Elijah into heaven by a whirlwind, that Elijah went with Elisha from Gilgal. And Elijah said unto Elisha, Tarry here, I pray thee, for the Lord hath sent me to Bethel. And Elisha said unto him, As the Lord liveth, and as thy soul liveth, I will not leave thee. So they went down to Bethel. And the sons of the prophets that were at Bethel came forth to Elisha, and said unto him, Knowest thou that the Lord will take away thy master from thy head today? And he said, Yea, I know it. Hold ye your peace. And Elijah said unto him, Elisha, tarry here, I pray thee, for the Lord hath sent me to Jericho. And he said, As the Lord liveth, and as thy soul liveth, I will not leave thee. All right. Are you understanding the concept on tonight? The man of God is trying to get him to quit. We need to be persistent. Come on, say, my eyes are on my desires. That's my text. My eyes are on my desires. Come on, shake somebody's hand and say, my eyes are on my desires. My desires. My desires. Desire. I have my eye, my eye. On, my on my desire. Come on, clap your hands for Jesus. Let's go to Mark 11 and 22 and come right back there. Mark 11, 22. Amen. All right. And Jesus answering saith unto them, Have faith in God. For verily I say unto you, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart, but shall believe that those things which he saith shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he saith. Therefore I say unto you, Whatsoever things ye desire when ye pray, Believe that ye receive them, and ye shall have them. My eyes on, are on my desires. People of God, you have got to turn away from the thing that you see that looks like it's impossible. The Bible clearly says to the believer, all things are possible. 
to them that believe. Now, your place is to set your will to believe. It's a very difficult place, but it's a choice. It's a decision. It's your thought. It's what you feed your mind. It's the place where you decide what you're putting in it. And when it looks like it's not going the way you think it ought to go, still set your desires on what you want. Do not let unbelief come from thoughts. Do not al allow it to stop you from getting what you want. It looks like it's not going to come. It acts like it's not going to come. It looks like you're a failure. But get your eyes off of failure. And get your eyes on your desire. Make up in your mind what you see in your spirit realm. What you imagine in your heart shall be your potion. Huh? Stop allowing fear to offset and to drag you down. Keep your eyes on your desire. Let me tell you, the word still says, I will give you the, the desires after your own heart. It looks like the enemy is winning. It looks like you're going to fail. But things tonight are not look the way they look like. Huh? It, it just looks like you can't have it. But you got to have a little talk with yourself. You got to set yourself down and say, let's talk. Because we got a problem. You are out trying to talk me. I'm trying to tell you what I want, and you're trying to tell me what I'm going to have. Now, I don't like your disposition. I don't like your attitude. So I advise you, if you want to get along with me, me. Me, you got to get along with me. Because me is telling me the wrong thing. Echo, shahabaha. And I don't like the way you feed me, me. Get over it. And let's line up with what thus said the Lord. I'm tired of you ruling me in all in the wrong direction. Oh, oh, I'm telling you the truth. You got to talk to me. Me is the one that's holding you back. Me. Oh, come on, get over everybody else. It's the man, the me in you that thinks different from the word of God in you. Ah. If you can get me to think like God thinks, he comes down every moment in the moment and searches your heart to, think, to find out what you're thinking about. And when he finished, he, uh, the angel records they're thinking about failure. They're thinking about unbelief. They're thinking about impossibilities. They're thinking about fear. That they can't get their thoughts right. They can't make up their mind. Hey. Your problem is me. Stop. Working with me and start controlling me. Come on, say, my problem is me. It's not you. Turn to your neighbor and say, it's not you. My problem is me. I can't get me to think right. Say, so, oh, but uh, tonight is my night. Tonight is my night. It's a me situation. It's a me that I'm dealing with. Me. Ooh. So I'm going to get me out the way and get God's word in me. Woo. So all you don't hear me, but I'm going to work on me. And I'm going to set me down and shake my face and be faith. And I'm going to set me down. Shake my finger in me face and say, get it together, me. <laughs> me fighting me. Brother, and these ought not to be. Not me fighting me. It's one thing if you fight me, but it's another thing if I fight me. My big.
biggest fight is with me. Oh, come on, give God some praise. All things are possible to him. Come on, holler back that, that, that believe. Mm. Mm. God said, I'll give you the desires after your own, own heart. What is unbelief doing to your heart? Why are you fighting so much with you? It's the enemy in me. I got an enemy and it's me. If I could beat me tonight, if I could beat me tonight, I could speak to my mountain. If I could beat me tonight, if I could beat me tonight, if I could beat me tonight, I could speak to my mountain and say, mountain be thou removed and cast in the sea and it shall obey and it shall obey. I can speak to poverty tonight and, and it shall obey. I can speak to my body tonight and it shall obey. I can speak to my job tonight and it shall obey. Come on, tell your neighbor, it's a me thing, it's a me thing, it's a me thing, it's a me thing, it's a me thing. Hey, but I'm going to get me together. I'm going to get me straight. I'm going to get me fixed. I'm going to turn me around. I'm going to turn me around. I got to work with me. Say, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm going to use the whole week on me. Hey. Mm. Mm. Somebody said, well, well, what's my problem? Me! Me. Me. Have you ever tried to work me and you tell me to go to church and me said, no, me stay at home. Huh? Have you ever told me that you can go to another level and do different things? And me said, no, you can't. Huh? Me said, I'm stuck. Me. Come on, say, that's me. That's me. I'm always talking to me. I'm always talking to me. And I, I, I always tell me, you can't excel. I tell me, stop trying. I tell me you're going to make a fool out of yourself. And, and every time me tell me I can own the city, I say, what's wrong with you, me? Don't you know I come from a poor family? Don't you know nobody got nothing? Me? What's wrong with you, me? I have to sit me down and say, calm down, me. You can't own 20 houses. Me, you can't have it. Me, you can't. Say, me, where you going? Why you think you can own a Rolls Royce? Me, you talk. Then you say, me, who told me I could have anything? Like, Who told me I couldn't have it? Me? Me? Who told me 
me I couldn't win? Who told me I was tired of trying? Who told me I was depressed? Who told me to stop? Come on, somebody say, wasn't nobody but me, wasn't nobody but me, wasn't nobody but me. Mm. Say, I'm to blame. But I'm going to set me down. I'm going to have a talk with me. Come on, come on, say, I, I can't help myself. I can't help myself. I'm going to talk to me. Say, in life, daddy and mama always talk, talked. It's time for us to talk about the birds and the bees. But now, it's time for me to talk about me. Come on. Some of y'all need to say, me, I'm tired of bouncing bad checks. I'm tired of paying late. Did you hear me, me? You pay your bills on time. Listen to me. Me. Don't got nothing you can't pay for me. Me, listen to me. No more late charges. No more bouncing checks. So I tell you, you better not. Say, watch me fix me. Nobody else couldn't fix me. But I'm going to fix me. Come on. Come on, just give me a big hand clap. Come on, say, that's the truth, me. Jesus. God is getting us ready for supernatural. The word of God said, I would to God that all of you prophesy. Hmm? That's what the word said. So me is going to prophesy to me. Come on, say, me, prophesy to me. There will come a change tonight at 12 o'clock. There will come a change. I will place the word in my spirit. All things are possible to me. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Now listen. 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 Now that's three bad twos you got to give up. You got to say, I'm going to give the devil his two back tonight. Get three things and say, this one is unbelief. I'm going to give it back. I'm going to give unbelief back. I'm going to give doubt back. I'm going to give fear back. I'm going to give it back. Huh? It's not mine. The devil lent it to me. But tonight I'm going to give it back. Come on, clap your hands for Jesus. Now, when you see yourself talking to yourself and say, you know, I wish that person would sit down because I don't believe a thing they say. You say, no, 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 no. 
me stop criticizing. Then somebody said, you know, I believe I'm going to get this new house. And then you sitting up there, I showed down there. I showed out there. I, I, child, I don't believe you can get it. I don't believe it's going to come your way. Huh? You got to stop doubting what people say, what you think. Stop buying in. Stop having a system of doubt. Fear. Stop anything fall in the house. It said, well, devil, get out of here. Huh? Just leave me alone because I'm not finna move. Huh? If they there, I'm just going to buy them until in the morning, but I'm going to sleep tonight. When you stop fearing, then the devil loses his control. Hmm? Yeah, you long as you stay in fear, you stopping your faith. Oh, Lord. Oh, fear. Come on, come on. You got to talk to me. Yeah. Stop. You got power. Elijah had so much power. We talked this morning. Elijah had power. And then he gave it to Elijah. Mm. Now he said, in, in the New Testament, there's 87 times the New Testament lists Elijah. Hmm? Six to three, they mention Elijah. But Elisha, with the J, was the major prophet. He got things out of the spirit realm that were unseemly, unrecognizable. Oh, God. He could cause the raven to feed him. He could cause meal to be created in a bear. He could bring in the spirit of God. He could bring it in just at his word, just at his word, talking to himself. He could say to the widow woman, but God sent me here. And he said he had prepared you to suffice me. He said, now I don't care what you don't have, but I'm about to tell you what you do. And if you do what I said do, then I'm going to create a supernatural ability in you. If you can believe, your whole life is about to change. Come on, somebody. So you got to bring me up to the level that your whole life believe in you. Come on, come on, come on. Give God the praise. He said, now, if you feed me with, with the little bread, you will never die. From starvation. Because I'm going to say out of my mouth a belief. And when it hits the elements, when it hits the air, God going to supernatural bypass the barley field. Bypass the olive tree. The time that it takes to grow an olive, I'm going to congest that time. I'm going to compile that time. I'm going to press that time and God going to supernaturally bypass the delays. Come on tell, tell your neighbor, me is about to bypass my delays. Now the corn or the barley has to be planted it has a weight to come up. It has to be harvested. Then it has to be grounded. Then it has to be cooked. Oh. But this man of God, because God was in him, 
could bypass the growth of the corn. Could bypass somebody out there tilling the soil. Bypass the harvest time, the rain, the planting. If me can believe all things are possible for me, God will bypass some things for me. Woo, I'm about to preach myself happy. So now, if I could understand that, then this woman at this man worry. Didn't have unbelief, didn't have doubt, didn't have fear. She just said, okay, my son and myself was going to die. I believe I would just give it to him. Mm-hmm. And we're going to start living. But her head was say, that's all you got, baby. But then her head said, that's all you need, honey. That's all you need to give away your last. But my me said, uh uh, I ain't no fool. My me said, I can't do it. My me says, I need this money to go to Walmart. My me said that. Mm hmm. My, I need this money to get me some shoes and another hat. My me says, I better to pay my condo. My me. Uh huh. Me said, I ain't gonna give it. But my spirit said all to Jesus. See, my me, my me said try. <laughs> That's what my me said. Who can tell whether God is not in the business of moving? That's, that's what my me said. Now, Elisha is saying this to this woman, but this is the part we're getting to. Elijah, come along. After he smoked the water, uh-huh, after he come across, then there were men, and they got hold to some poison water. They got hold to some poison water. And in this poison water, then we see, we, well, what is going to happen? Will they die? But Elijah said, but I, got, I still got the mantle. I got the mantle. Then he looked up and said, Father, what you want me to do? See, sometimes I tell y'all to do some things, and it's just crazy. But if you do what the prophet is saying, yes. you'll have what you desire. Right. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to make sense to you because it didn't make sense to Elijah. Now the Lord has said, just take some salt and give thanks. Throw it in the water, Elijah, and go on back to sleep. I'm putting it in my word. The Bible didn't say that. The Bible said about the soul. <laughs> but I put the rest of it in my word. But as soon as the salt hit the water, it taken the poison out of the water. That's supernatural. That's unexplainable. And everything that God does is supernatural. It's unexplainable. You don't understand what God is doing. But you need to understand, it's my job to do it. Hmm? It's, job, it's God's job to tell me what to do. And it's my job to get me out the way and do it. Now in this church, y'all believe me. I know you do, because um, Ruth Shaneria told me, my boss lady, she just acquired the position. She says, 
Pastor, yesterday, we don't want nobody else to preach to us. This is Miracle Sunday. Now, did I listen? Yeah. She's young and she's mine, but she paid tithe. So I listen. <laughs> I say, isn't this a mess? But she said, I want my miracle. We want our miracle. We need our miracle. So since we need our miracle, and she said, we believe in other people. But we know what you've done. Theirs has got to be tested. But now, yours have been tested. Uh-huh. So tonight, we're getting ready for our miracles. We want to be free. Now, if I could get you to understand this, we're going to go into our miracles. Everything that you've gotten. Let's see. Minister Michael was here. I'm going to say it real, real quick and real good. I like 19 years with Minister Michael and Sister Mia because I feel like I earn every year. feel like buying myself a present. <laughs> to celebrate. <laughs> I really do. I feel like buying myself a present to celebrate. <laughs> I got Minister Dobson up there laughing and said, it must be funny. <laughs> because it was difficult. It was difficult, but nevertheless, through everything, they have hung together. Right, 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 right. Now, I, I used to give Minister Michael this credit. I don't know where it belongs now. But it used to be Minister Michael that wanted the marriage. I don't know where, where the ball lies now, so, but I'm going to leave that alone. But what I'm trying to get you to understand, my job has been in the creative arena. I have been able to create an atmosphere to get new cars. Uh-huh. Now, because I speak it in the atmosphere, it comes together. I was talking to Missionary Evers today in my office, and she said even when she couldn't even drive, my testimony enabled her to drive. My testimony enabled George Dobson to drive and to get licensed. That girl learned, I, I kept on saying, learn to drive. Then the girl started driving, and it taking us years to get some license. <laughs> yeah. She just didn't want to be bothered with those folk. She wanted to drive on her own. <laughs> but she managed to get license. Hallelujah. But what I'm getting to, to tell you tonight is because of the office of a prophetess. People have gotten married. People have gotten homes. 
People have gotten financed. People have gotten set free. People have gotten delivered. Come on, somebody. Yes. People have come off of problems that they could not be. But me is going to get together with me. And everybody that's barren, if you believe it, stand up and let's get it together. Barren. Want a child. I, that's all right, Brother Thomas. You remember I preached the sermon, the barrenness is over. Maybe Brother Thomas is wanting that daughter. <laughs> and he don't know it. But he declares it. He declares it, it, it. It's enough. Come on, Vanessa. All right, let me line y'all up together. Mm -hmm. Hey, we are in church. Don't do that. If Elisha, by the spirit of prophecy, could speak, I don't care the situation. I have no problem with it. I've been there. And my first godson, Reginald Jones, is here and in prison. <laughs> That's a bad testimony, but he's here. And he the Spirit of God was so anxious to get him, get him here until she carried him outside of the womb. Right. Yes. And the doctor said, this is a miracle. Yes, they said, when the baby was three months old, we said, well, we'll wait. They said, we'll wait because it just will abort itself and we won't have to operate. Then when it got so big, they said, well, what is it feeding off? How can it live? But it lived the whole nine months with the doctors expecting it to board. Because we commanded him to stay until the full time. I ain't been tested, tried, and miracles has happened. Huh? But tonight, I'm going up. Me owe me $300. You can get out the line anytime. Me owe me $300. Me owe me $300. But what's important to me is to get me a child. See yourself with $301 bills in your hand. Offer this hand, not this one, because this one is impossible. But offer this and say, this hand gives you $300. Because this hand, believe me, is pregnant by the end of this year. No more. Me believes I can have, get pregnant within three months in spite. I give me, come on, talk to me. I give me three months. I give me, I told her, 
I give it to her. I give her her baby. Me. Me a baby. Me. Come on church. It is so. Three months. Put this hand on and say I believe it. I receive it. Now, 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 Ooh. all right, tonight, go out and buy that son a suit. I didn't say buy a wardrobe. Say, come on, and let mama put you in your mouth. Woo, say, let mama put you in this. Ah, say so let mama say so come to mama. Come on, say it now. Come to mama. Come to mama. Come on, give God praises. Go your way and receive your devour. Shake Abraham Johnson's hand because she got she on. Uh, you can shake Ella's hand because she got all of those. It could order a book. $300. You going to back out the line? I break and I block everything that stopped this normal baby from around. I break and I stop it and it shall be and it shall be and it shall be there shall be no delays I break a delay spirit. Come now! In Jesus' name. Go your way and be blessed. Mm. Get me out the way. Me. Fight with me. Because I'm having a problem trying to get through here. Get me out the way. Get me out the way. Come on, come on. Uh, get me. Come on, come on. Are you about to bring it? Me. I see me pregnant. I see me having a big, a, a beautiful baby. I s- now! Now! Me! Tell tell them, just call me mama. Just call me mama. Come on, in the spirit, say mother. Call your mother in the spirit, say mama. Guess what? I'm pregnant. Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Come on, come on. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on. Come on, come. You're birthing it. You're birthing it. You're birthing this, this, this miracle. See yourself holding. See yourself holding your baby. See yourself holding your baby. Come on, somebody help her praise. Somebody help her praise. Help her praise. Help her praise. Help her praise.
Come on, say me. I can do it. Me. I can do it. It's mine. It's mine. This baby is mine. I don't care. Come on, come on, get that me out of the way. I see, I see fear and unbelief and what if. No, 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 no. Talk, talk to me. Come on, say, me, we going to do it. Me. Come on, Sister Ellen, shake her hand. Say, be blessed. I speak it into existence. Say, look over there. Look what I got. You can have as many as I got if you want to. God bless. Come on, somebody say it's supernatural. It's supernatural. Mm. I hope y'all don't think I'm joking. I believe it so strong. Why you believe it, Sister Dobson? Oh, I feel a miracle deliverance power coming in. I'm waiting on your faith. I am waiting on the possibility phase. I'm waiting on. I'm telling you, those things that I just prophesied are taking place in the spirit realm right now. When a prophet, a prophet is give a blessing, it's spiritual. Then it comes from heaven and it hits, hits you. Then it manifests. It manifests. You can't see the giver. You can't see it coming. But when it comes, it's, it's well. Where is that right earache? Where's the right ear ache? All right, we're moving from there. It, it's plugged up. Sha ha, take care, boy. And it is so. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. That ain't all other boy. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. In another wishing, another day was shy. Sister Scurry, come. It is well with my soul. It is well. 
It is well with my soul. It is well with my soul. It is well. It is well with my soul. It is well with my soul. It is well, it is well with my soul. Is it well with your soul? It is well, it is well with my soul. I've said on the telephone, you're going to get a new building. But I see nine new beds. I see nine new beds unexpectedly. I see nine new beds with the voucher. I see nine new beds on a check. With my soul. I'm going to pray for you, but look out and get somebody because it's going to happen like that. You need to be looking for a building because nine new people are going to come. And what I see is you're going to be caught short. It's coming too fast. I'm going to open up Where's somebody else? She's drunk Nine new students I call you in. I give her the help to keep them. I give her the place to put them and the help. Ah, now, 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 now. Hey, Jesus, now. Woo. Thank you, Lord. Is it well with your soul? Is it well? Is it well with you? It is well with my soul. With my soul. It is well. It is well with my soul. It is well. With my soul, it is well. It is well with my soul. It is well with my soul. It is well. It is well with my soul. But is it well with your soul? It is well 
Laquisha, Darlings, Tamara, Ruth, Jamie, Keisha. Can y'all help me to sing that? It is well. Everybody that want to be married, everybody that want to be married, it is well with my soul. Let me just charge them. Tonight, based on the office of the prophecy, I declare, I declare in the spirit realm, every curse covenant must move. Every deceitful person that don't mean you any good. I declare and decree. I form a line. Stay right there. Form a line. Form a Is it well with my soul? With my soul, it is well. It is well with my soul. Is it well? It is well with my soul. With my soul, it is well. It is well with my soul. Ooh, I like this. I like this. Wait, 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 wait. How many people I have, Ruth, Shanira? Because I'm going to have church growth. I'm going to have church growth up in here. Oh, 20. All right. I I need church growth. How many of y'all can believe for church growth? Y'all bringing them all to redeem, right? Church growth. Oh, I can believe now. <laughs> oh, I got all kind of faith. Overseer, come down. I got church growth going on. I got 20 what? Woo! That's how many people, Sister Edward? Oh. Ah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay, okay, okay. I, I feel the spirit. I feel the spirit. I feel the spirit. I feel the spirit. My God, church grow. Church grow. Church grow. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Listen, hold, hold on, hold on. Me got to get me out the way. Me has been talking to me. And me has said nobody will marry me. Me says I'm tired of waiting on me. But me says tonight, repeat after me, I release, I release out, of my mouth out of my mouth words, words that, will cause my that will cause my spouse to come immediately. Come, spouse. Come now. now. My words attract you. Now let hold on one more time. Now, don't play just a minute. This is this is what I feel like the last. I believe in talking in the spirit. That which is flesh, that which is spirit. So now if I can talk in the flesh, then I ought to be able to walk in the spirit and talk in the spirit. Because the scripture said we walk in the spirit. And if I can walk in the spirit, Sister Boston, I can also talk in the spirit. So when I started to talk, praying for you, you started to summerson because you I want you to talk in the spirit. I want you to talk in the spirit.